Go ahead. Hi, everybody. This is Marie from the Art Below and Achievement Center, and I'm going to show you guys what is in a first aid kit. So, in your first aid kit, we have some scissors and also some tweezers. The tweezers can be used to get splinters out or um, if you step on a piece of glass or something, then you can use these to try to get it out of your foot with. And the scissors you can use to cut old bandages off or if you need to, in a severe injury, cut your clothes away, you can use them for that. Um, this has some butterfly bandages which will help keep your skin closed if you get a really deep cut that might need stitches. So there's just different sizes band-aids. Then we have some medical tape that you can use to hold down gauze. This is Neosporin. It is antibiotic ointment, which you should put on um, a wound that you have already cleaned with antibacterial soap or a, um, what's it called? They can edit this, right? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Um, antibacterial soap or peroxide. You'll want to put that on your wound. Um, this is just another kind of medical tape that you can wrap around gauze as well. It's very sticky. And this here is your alcohol prep pads. You can clean the area with that as well. And not all first aid kits come with these, but this has antacids and um, aspirins in case you have a stomach ache or um, some kind of pain somewhere else. There is burn cream. If you burn yourself, you can put that on the burn. And then back here, it comes with uh, latex gloves. You always want to wear gloves, especially if you're helping somebody else clean their wound and bandage their wound. <clears throat> and this is a survival wrap. It's used um, to prevent um, like heat loss if you're stuck in the snow and you get over cold or frozen. Then you'll wrap, you could wrap yourself up with that and it's supposed to keep you from getting hypothermia. And this is a cold compress and you, it's only good for one time use, but you can break it up and crunch it up and it turns into like an ice pack if you need to put it on um, an area to prevent swelling or inflammation. Oh. <clears throat> uh, so this is basic first aid kit. There's some I don't know what they would be using. Depressors. Oh, you can use these if you break a bone. You can make a splint out of it. Triangular bandage. Uh, this is just a really large bandage. Maybe if you bump your head really hard and cut your head open, you could use that. And then some of them come with emergency telephone numbers. If, if you keep this in your home, then it's always good to have like a number where you can get a hold of your doctor, your um, local ambulance agency, poison control center, hospital, and then you can put your own emergency contacts on it as well. And I think that's about it for what's in the first aid kit.